Some people call me the space cowboy. We really didn't talk about that all that much. We were both Navy test pilots, and it just kind of happened that we both applied at the same time. He actually applied for the selection before we both got selected and didn't get picked, and then I got picked on my first time. We got this twin thing going here, that's for sure. D did your mom dress you guys alike when you were little? Uh, she did when we were little. I think when we got old enough to protest, then that came to an end. Well, who flew on the shuttle first? Uh, I did. I flew in uh, 1999 on a Hubble Space Telescope repair mission. Okay. What do you think about that, Mark? He beat you. Oh, that was great. I mean, he was the first American in our class to fly. And then uh, I flew in 2001, and then I flew again in 06 and 08. Yeah, he'll he'll have me beat in a number of flights, but with my almost six months on the space station, I'll I'll crush him in number of days. <laughs> stop stop gloating. <laughs> well, you're both engineers, uh, uh, Mark. Your degree in marine engineering, if I've got that right, and Scott, you're an electrical engineer. Uh, boy, why the divergence there? I have no idea. Yeah, I think you know just what we're interested in at the time. But I don't think my brother remembers anything about electrical engineering, so I think he's right. <laughs> <laughs> what did your parents think about both of you being part of a program that comes with quite a bit of risk along with that space cowboy grit, Scott? They, uh, like, you know, many parents are, are naturally nervous when their children fly in space. But, uh, you know, for them, they have to deal with it uh, more times than most uh, parents of astronauts. Mark having flown three times, me twice, and, uh, you know, soon uh, each of us will fly at least one more time. They, you know, they handle it generally pretty well until it gets really close because I've, I've sat in the bleachers with them at the Kennedy Space Center the two times my brother flew. And, you know, they get a, they get a little nervous, but I think most parents, uh, you know, people in our profession do. I'm wondering if there is a policy at NASA against both of you flying at the same time. There isn't a policy. Uh, there was some discussion about us flying on the same uh, space shuttle mission at one time, but the fact that we're both in the same astronaut class really didn't quite work out, but uh, there's no uh, written policy about us uh, doing that. Actually, we were not supposed to. I mean, this wasn't planned. You know, my launch date for STS-134 slipped, and my brother launches in October, and mine moved into February of next year, so we just happened to be in space together. And that's the final mission. How do you feel about that, Mark? There's a lot of talk about adding an additional one in the summer of 2011. I think that's uh, very likely. But it'll be the last flight of Space Shuttle Endeavor. Uh, you know, it's one of those things that's necessary for us to move on and do something else, but it'll be a little sad at the same time.